Hi, I'm Gabriel Moss, Senior Editor at Yanko Design, here to talk about the upcoming October 30 Apple event. Rumors have been floating around throughout 2023 about the new upcoming Apple M3 chip, and reports have sprung up throughout October about the potential for a sudden announcement and subsequent release of new M3-based MacBook computers and potentially a new M3-based iMac. Now, this is a big deal for a few reasons. First, Apple's M3 chip uses a 3 nanometer process that equals more room for transistors and therefore offers more performance across the board, even allowing for better power efficiency and battery life in, say, a new MacBook Pro or a new MacBook Air. Second, if a new M3-based iMac does indeed come along to finally replace the 2021 model 24-inch iMac, which used Apple's slightly older M1 chip, that could translate to some serious performance gains for the next generation of iMac. And based on the graphic that appears on Apple's website that turns into the Mac Finder icon, it's it, it's gonna be in, it's gonna be Mac related. Fortunately for everyone, both inside and outside of the press, the Apple event on October 30 will be fully virtual, and you will get to watch it straight from the comfort of your couch on Apple's official YouTube channel. The only catch, unlike regular Apple events which begin in the morning, this one is at 5 p.m. PT. Which is great, because I'm here in Portland, Oregon, but it's probably not so great if you live outside of the United States, in which case you may end up watching very late into the night to catch Apple's scary fast Mac reveals. Ming-Chi Kuo, one of the most respected Apple analysts on the web, took to X on October 24th with a valuable insight about what we can expect from the upcoming Apple event, saying, I believe M3 series MacBook Pro will be the October 30th media event's focus, I previously predicted a launch this year is unlikely due to limited fourth quarter shipments, less than 400 to 500,000 units in total. If new MacBook Pros launch between November and December, tight supply will last into the first quarter of 2024 unless demand weakens. That said, until we witness an official reveal unfolding in front of our own eyes, everything you see on the internet about this upcoming October 30 Apple event is still just speculation. Regardless of how obvious Apple has been that it's going to be Mac related, and how on point analysts like Ming-Chi Kuo and Mark Gurman have been about MacBook updates in the past. Until anything is officially revealed by Apple though, I'll be sitting here at my little desk speculating along with everyone else who's waiting with bated breath. If you liked this video and you want to see more like it, make sure to click those like and subscribe buttons. Once again, this is Gabriel Moss, Senior Editor at Yanko Design, signing off.